we are here just off Canaan Road and we've seen this all the time with our fires in the wildland urban's interface particularly in the Santa Monica Mountains <clears throat> obviously this fire has had huge impacts on our flora and fauna and people have a great heart they're very worried about critters so they feel that these critters don't have food anymore to eat and so uh, you know with with justifiable <laughs> with you know there's a solid reasoning for that but what somebody's come out here is <clears throat> come here and done and is to uh, spread some vegetables so there's some carrots over there there's some wilted lettuce here now there's a whole lot of berries and uh, uh, strawberries raspberries that kind of stuff and then of course the ubiquitous water jugs so very sweet um, very well intentioned good um, open-hearted folks the problem is what typically happens is uh, people do this they pull their car off the side of the road again this is Canaan Road right there so we're about oh uh, 200 meters or so from the roadbed and so people pull off and they they leave these items here and what this is going to do is not going to help too much you can see uh, unclear when these things were left out but but nothing's been nibbled here right if this is this is a regular day if this is a regular place these things would have been gobbled up by birds etc very few birds uh relatively speaking remain in the area see i've been seeing a lot of dead rabbits and and uh other mammals so the fact one the fact these things haven't been eaten tells me that there isn't a high demand for these things two um, if we by some chance uh, uh, some critters stumble upon these and find these guys that's great but they're gonna tend to come over here again they're gonna tend to be attracted to the road right here and they're gonna be much more likely to be whacked on this road and become roadkill unfortunately so while very very well intentioned uh, very warm-hearted people doing this um, this is not the best thing to do for our wildlife this is not going to help them uh, truly if we don't have water sources truly if we don't have um, vegetative support for these critters they have to disperse to another area while this uh, burned region recovers and putting out enticements like this is only going to slow that process and act to delay their movement which in the long term um, could actually cause more harm than good so love the sentiment, but it'd be best if people did not put out food and water and carrots uh, for these critters uh, in the wake of, in this case, the Woolsey fire, but pretty much in the case of any fire.